already, we got different widths with the different options. And I, I don't know that everybody understands what we mean when we say widths. Can you draw on there and show how there's really different widths? All of them have a lot of angle. Yeah, bounce is good. So they all have a lot of bounce, height and angle on them. I'm a big fan of bounce because the skid plate, as I like to call it, will help the club glide if you know how to use it properly and, and you've designed this to do this perfectly. Yeah. So what we've done here is we've created three different widths which I'll draw kind of where the relief angle is and where the low point on the sole is. Okay. So the TS here, you can see the relief angle is a little closer to the face, the low point. Okay. That's going to work a little better with the turf is firm or if you're a little shallower in your attack angle and your delivery. Okay. The standard sole, the low point it's kind of between the thin and the wide, but we still have a plenty of relief angle towards the heel side, and that really helps with shot making when you open the face. The wide sole, the low point, is, takes up almost the entire sole, but again, you can see how well we've relieved the, the heel, um, so you don't lose all your shot making capability, even though you have a lot more forgiveness and width for full shots. So that's amazing when you have a club that's wide with a lot of bounce, you actually have an area toward the heel that you can learn to play with less bounce. Absolutely. And it gives you a lot of versatility. Yeah, we've seen plenty of good players fit into the wide sole for their conditions, and they don't totally give up all their shot making. Fantastic.